Dr. Mamadou Baumia, along with party executives, visited four constituencies to campaign for votes ahead of the December 7 polls. The delegation first visited the Wejagbari constituency, where the NPP flag bearer visited five churches. <laughs> Dr. Baumia taxed the public to pursue peace during this electioneering season. What we need in Ghana now is prayers because we are going into an election. Election is about exercising of one's opinion. We don't want any violence to mar it. In the Anyasu Otum constituency, Dr. Baumia met and greeted residents discussing his manifesto promises with them. He later held a rally to outline his vision and direction for the country. Parliamentary candidate for Anyas Wotum, Elder Emmanuel Tobin, promised that the NPP would secure 75% of the total valid votes in the constituency. <laughs> You and I must work hard towards the elections ahead of us. We have to work even harder to give the new patriotic party 75% vote in this constituency. We are not giving NPP anything less than 75%. Dr. Baumia stated that his next administration would reform the process of acquiring passports in the country. application, easy crime. When I win power in December, passport acquisition will be very easy for all because with your Ghana card, you will only require the passport will be printed for you. You will not need to fill any form again. We were Ghana card and one no. He also took a job as his main contender, John Dramani Mahama. We don't need day old chicks, neither do we need 24 hour discotheque in Ghana. We rather need minds that can proffer solutions to complex problems. In the same constituency, the vice president engaged TESCON members of the Pentecost University as well as chiefs and grassroots supporters of the NPP. The NPP campaign team also visited the Obum Domiara and English Amount from constituencies, encouraging eligible voters to support the NPP in the upcoming elections. Stanley Nibleu, TV3 News, Accra.